There are three things you need to know about Poppy's Playtime Chapter 3. One, if nothing else, the audio design and score will make this game for you. This isn't quite Amnesia the Bunker levels of I am being slowly hunted by a force of nature that shall surely kill me and is breathing in my ear right now when oh god make it stop, but it is damn near close. Two, the puzzle solving and apparent bugs, though I didn't catch any myself, may leave you cold at times. But then a flaming wind-up toy car will get you fired up? Why did I write that? Just when a puzzle section frustrated me, I'd put in a videotape that genuinely sent shivers down my spine. Not due to what I was seeing, but what was being described to me. I bought in, and the game's improved writing and overall pacing compared to earlier titles certainly helped with that. And three, take your time. Get used to the new hands and items and haunting environments of this orphanage. So when it's time to be hunted, you just might be ready for it.